You know what I wanted to always hear? Crazy as it sounds. Um, Marley Scratch. Like, Marley Scratch to me was hip hop. It sounded like hip hop. It, it had all the flavors of hip hop. Shout out to MC Shan. You know what I'm saying? It was raw MCing. It was, you know what I'm saying? It was the beat. Boom, ba ba boom, ba boom, ba. Marley Scratch was a record that, to me, resonated hip hop. And to know that it came from Marley Maul, who was on the air, you know, a young brother like me, to be able to put it on the air and to, to show the city what hip hop sounded like, man, there's nothing like it, man. Marley Scratch, by far. Oh, man, Craig G used to go forever. Like, Craig G, shout to Craig G. Craig G, shout to the whole Juice Crew, matter of fact. Um, but Craig G used to just be ready to battle. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what hip hop is about. This still got the battle element. It's a little different now. It's a little more vulgar to me. It's less really lyrical. But back then, it was, I come from the park. I come from two turntables and a microphone. I come from putting your speakers out and the DJ just cutting the break beats and the MC's going to the mic and rhyming. And Craig G was like, at that time, especially the late 80s, early 90s, Craig G was like the best one ever to me. Like he used to just, just grab a mic and off the top of the dome, just start rhyming, man. And that's hip hop, you know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm living and that's the things that I try to bring to the station nowadays, just that raw feel of what music supposed to sound like, especially New York City music.